hello guys and welcome back to the channel now guys you can never really keep this guy out of the news he has this insatiable need for attention almost to the level of fanikayode or omokri etc i am talking of course of festus kiyamo who has been made a junior minister to keep his mouth quiet somewhere but of course being the loud mouth that he is he has an opinion on everything so with that guys i bring you this hate speech slash social media bill festus kiyamo mocks social media influencers state's position on controversial bills so that's the headline hate speech slash social media bill uh festus kiyamo mocks social media influencers state's position on controversial bills so now let's see now what this are uh, shouting San has to say this time around. The Minister of State for Labour, Festus Kiyamo, has spoken on the controversy surrounding hate speech and social media bill in Nigeria. It had been reported that a group of Nigerians on Wednesday protested at the National Assembly over the hate speech bill. The protesters demanded the withdrawal of the bills on hate speech and internet manipulation. Reacting to the outcry and protest, Kiyamo condemned the death sentence penalty for hate speech bill. He, however, urged those opposing social media bill to also apologize to those they blocked on their social media pages. On his Twitter page, Kiyamo wrote, those so-called overnight social media activists who oppose the social media bill should first stop blocking those who irritate them with insults unblock all those they have blocked and apologize to them you can't be intolerant and ask others to be i don't know what that means but that is what he said you can't be intolerant and ask others to be so you can't be intolerant and ask others not to be is probably what he intended to write there practice what you preach some cannot differentiate the social media bill from the hate speech bill whilst no reasonable person will support death sentence for hate speech you can't come online to say something totally untrue that can put others lives in danger without some kind of penal consequence so now this is a guy of course now that has been put in the ministry of labor you will recall of course that nigeria is in the throes of negotiations and battles for minimum wage so you think that he will be busy enough but no he's not busy enough to seek attention of course because as i said this guy has that insatiable need for attention and publicity almost to the level of a fanny coyote and certainly to the level of uh that omokri what is his name again his first name i can't recall his first name uh reno omokri so that is really what is going on here attention seeking yet again from the shouting senior advocate of nigeria come tell me what you are making of this uh kiyamo fella hate speech well i think the guy is a clown i wonder if that uh classifies come tell me what your thoughts are about all this silliness the hate speech uh, bill the social media bill or the anti-social media bill as the nigerian uh, population have now tagged it and uh, especially this guy now running commentaries where he should be otherwise busy come tell me what your thoughts are about all this but before you come share thoughts Click on the red subscribe button so it turns grey. Bell button notifies you every time I drop a new vid. Then come tell me what you're making of the going on in Nigeria in the comment section. So I'll leave you here. Join me in the comment section. But here, I say peace.